Hey YouTube, I got a comment on my video on how much I like the YouTube TV and Apple TV combination from a guy who says, you do know the connection speed is lower through Cat5e instead of Wi-Fi, depending on your Wi-Fi router. Not to burst your bubbles, but the network Ethernet card in the Apple TV is 100 megabits per second and the Wi-Fi is 300 megabits per second. He figured it out by doing speed test when I first got Spectrum Cable, I was supposed to get 100 megabits per second. And when I tested it on my iMac using Wi-Fi, I was only getting 50 megabits per second. So I called them up and says, hey, I'm not getting 100 megabits per second. They said, you will only get 100 megabits per second if you do it hardwired through an Ethernet cable. So I hooked up my iMac to an Ethernet cable and tested it, and I got 100 megabits per second. So. I will be very surprised if my Apple TV works differently, but let's find out. So here I have the Apple TV hooked up to a hardwired Ethernet cable. And I'm going to run speedtest.net and let's see what we get. Looks like it's going to be a little over 90 megabits per second. So 91 download and 11.6 upload over Ethernet cable. Here I have the Apple TV hooked up to Wi-Fi now and we will run speedtest.net and see what we get. Looks like it's going to be about 47 megabits per second or half what I got over hardwired. So that's perfectly consistent with what I experienced with my iMac using my router, my cable modem router. Your experience may differ based on your cable modem router, and I recommend you try both ways and see which is faster. 